inside these trucks is what put a smile on the face of every farmer, especially those battling with the impacts of soil degradation. The OCP company in Senegal will be transporting 15 metric tons of fertilizer into the country, courtesy of the Gambia government. This fertilizer is wholly and solely owned by the farmers. That has to be very clear. And it will be followed by monitoring. Regional authorities in the North Bank promise to work hand in glove to ensure the protection of the fertilizer from illegal traders. One of the key factors driving low agricultural production and productivity is soil fertility. Fatou Jamet Toure, Deputy Permanent Secretary, Programs and Projects at the Ministry of Agriculture, disclosed that timely distribution of inputs to farmers is one of the top priorities of the government. The Ministry of Agriculture, through the CPCU, has successfully procured 15,000 met 15, metric tons of assorted fertilizer packaged in 50 kilogram bags. This convoy of trucks is here to deliver the first consignment of the assorted fertilizer, which comprises of five metric tons of NPK 151515, 15, five metric tons of NPK 102010, 10, and five metric tons of urea 0460. Ladies and gentlemen, the CPCU is working closely with the National Food Security Processing Marketing Corporation, known as DGC, and the Department of Agriculture and its decentralized structures to facilitate easy access of fertilizer to our gland smallholder farmers across the country. Furthermore, the availability of fertilizer in country will significantly increase both crop production and productivity this year. The imported fertilizer is also part of the government's overall objective of transforming agriculture into a lucrative business to encourage youth participation. Abdullah Toure, coordinator CPCU and the Giraffe Project, thanked the World Bank through the Gambia government for supporting the intervention. Giraffe is a World Bank funded project and the government of the Gambia supporting the policies of the government, the national development uh, plan, as well as the Agricultural Gambia National Investment Program called the GINAIP, just to improve production and productivity. These are chemical we all know. We have to teach our farmers, even people working with this chemical fertilizer has to be protected, and even storage is also important. So we are not taking uh, anything lightly to make sure that it reaches to the farmers. Abdullah Toure, Director National Food Security, Processing and Marketing Corporation, commended the Gambia government for the timely arrival of the fertilizer. This is a huge quantity that is uh, actually going to go a long way uh, in addressing the fertilizer uh, deficiency in this country, as highlighted by the coordinator. So we are definitely uh, delighted and happy uh, to work uh, with the CPCU uh, to make sure that uh, this is uh, actually uh, accessible to, to the fertilizer and on time. Uh, I think uh, there is no doubt uh, absolutely that uh, it will help the farmers to increase uh, productivity, but also uh, uh, support government uh, in uh, its drive to actually uh, ensure food uh, security uh, in the country. Earlier last year, the Giraffe Project provided farmers across the country with seeds and other inputs to boost production and productivity. For the news, I am Farmer Kanye.